In today's video, we're going to talk about a historical event that shook the ancient city of Constantinople to its core, the Nika Riots. Also known as the Nika Revolt, the riots took place in the year 532 AD during the reign of Byzantine Emperor Justinian I. The riots were sparked by tensions between two factions of chariot racing fans, known as the Blues and the Greens. These factions were not just sports clubs, but wielded political and social power throughout Constantinople. The riot started on January 13th, 532, during a chariot race at the Hippodrome, the largest and most important public entertainment venue in Constantinople. Justinian had organized an elaborate festival of chariot races in an attempt to appease the people of the city, who had become increasingly unruly. Food shortages were common in the city due to poor harvests as well as the interruption of trade routes throughout the empire, and the government was not providing adequate supplies or relief. As a result, food prices skyrocketed and many people could not afford to buy enough food to feed their families. Inflation was also a significant problem. The value of the currency was rapidly declining due to a combination of government overspending and debasement of the coinage. This meant that even those who had money could not afford to buy as much as they used to, exacerbating the food shortage problem. These challenges created a sense of desperation among the people, who looked to their emperor for solutions, but found none. The Blues and the Greens, who had been bitter rivals for years, put aside their differences and united against their common enemy, Emperor Justinian. The crowds quickly grew violent, with Greens and Blues fighting each other in the stadium, but soon turned their anger towards the Emperor and his government. The crowd began attacking government officials at the races, chanting the word Nika, a word that means conquer. The riots quickly escalated and spread throughout the city, with arson, looting, and attacks on government officials commonplace throughout every corner. The Emperor's palace was besieged, and the rioters demanded the release of prisoners and the removal of corrupt officials. Justinian was initially taken aback by the severity of the riots and considered fleeing the city, leaving it to the mob. However, his wife, Empress Theodora, convinced him to stay and take decisive action. Justinian ordered the military to suppress the riots with force, and they managed to regain control of the city after several days of brutal fighting. The aftermath of the riots was devastating. Tens of thousands of people were killed, and much of the city was destroyed. However, Emperor Justinian recognized the urgent need to restore order and bring peace to the city of Constantinople. He implemented a series of reforms and initiatives aimed at addressing the issues that had sparked the rebellion in the first place. One of his first actions was to provide much needed food supplies to the people of the city. He imported grain from Egypt and distributed it to the needy at a subsidized price, which helped to alleviate the food shortage crisis. Justinian also implemented economic reforms to address the issue of inflation. He reformed the tax system and reduced government overspending, which helped stabilize the value of the currency and restore confidence in the economy. The emperor also invested heavily in the reconstruction and beautification of Constantinople. He oversaw the construction of new buildings, including the magnificent Hagia Sophia, which became a symbol of his commitment to rebuilding the city. Justinian's efforts to restore order and rebuild the city were successful, and Constantinople emerged from the ruins of the Nika riots stronger and more prosperous than ever before. The reforms he implemented had a lasting impact on the city and helped to establish it as one of the great cultural and economic centers of the world. The Nika riots were a turning point in the history of Constantinople, and Justinian's response to the rebellion played a crucial role in shaping the city's future. Through his leadership and vision, he was able to restore order and rebuild the city, leaving a lasting legacy that is still felt today. I hope you enjoyed this video, and thank you for staying until the end. If you'd like to see more videos like this, please subscribe to the channel to see new ones as they come out.